Hey, good afternoon, guys. It's Steve Calf, 5 JUF. Hope everyone's doing okay out there today. Got a subscriber sent me some new settings uh, for the parametric e equalizer, settings for the parametric equalizer with the processor off, and another set, a set of settings for the processor on. So I thought, you know what, it'd be a good time to do a quick video, just review real quick exactly what's going on with the FT991A and its parametric equalizer. So what we'll do is we'll go through and we'll demonstrate uh, some of the audio uh, quality. I'll go through and uh, show you some of the different, uh, kind of some of the theory, uh, a little bit about each one of the different uh, parametric equalizers and the settings. We'll also discuss the transmit uh, bass pan, uh, bandpass filter, which uh, helps you give you a much uh, richer, deeper audio. So I'll go through and do that. We'll do all that on the radio, but this is just kind of a quick overview. I'll talk about the microphone, dummy load, uh, two modes for the parametric equalizer, transmit bandpass. This is the microphone I use, it's the M100. Essentially there's two configurations I use it in. One of them is in sideband mode which uses this little guy right here, this little treble boost cowling they call it. And the other mode is I use simply for FM and that is we just speak right into the microphone itself. These are my settings here too. Um, basically I've got uh, these guys are all turned on here and then in this one here I have these two turned on. So those are the microphone settings. For testing, we always want to use a dummy load. They recommend 5 watts low power. Uh, dummy load is a good thing because it is a balanced feed line system, and that doesn't give you any crazy things going on uh, with, um, you know, an imbalanced feed line. Can, can affect some of your ALC operation and various things like that. So you, you want to try to do all of this in a uh, kind of a laboratory environment. Test Good test fixture with the balanced feed line, and a dummy load does does just the perfect job. All right, so the first uh, parametric equalizer we'll talk about is the settings 119 through 127. These are specific for the parametric equalizer that does not use the processor. So in this mode here, we do not use the processor. Uh, typically, these modes here will be AM, and you can also do this in sideband. You can talk on sideband with the processor turned off. It's an option. gives you a little bit more uh, richer, deeper uh, audio, the processor is going to give you a little more uh, condensed uh, audio quality. So it, it, each one is kind of unique. I personally like the processor on when I'm talking sideband because it does help. So let's talk about these settings real quick here. Essentially, there's going to be nine settings. Each one of them has three specific settings, and each one of those specific settings is for a particular region within the voice spectrum. So what you're looking at over here is each one of these corresponds to a specific region in the voice. So this first group here is this group here. That group is for the middle. And that group is for the third. So what you're looking at here, essentially, you're looking at frequency response and center frequency, if you will. They're calling it center frequency. And what we're doing here is from that, we are able to adjust the uh, Q factor, which is the width uh, or how much of a response is there. And then the lastly is the Y factor, which is the gain, which is how much, you know, dB up or dB down, you know, how much that is uh, emphasized uh, in that particular voice region. So that's what these settings are. Now we have a different group of processor settings for the speech processor turned on. Uh, and again, these are all my settings for the processor. So if you you know want to kind of take a note here, these are something that, that I find work pretty good. So you've got a whole another processor, but it's specifically designed for the parametric equalizer. And the way you tell it real quick is the parametric equalizer without the processor looks like this here. So just kind of note, notice there's not a P right there. No P right there. Now when we go over here, notice the P is in front of it. That P stands for processor. That's what that P, the P you see right there, that means these are parametric settings with the processor engaged. So essentially you have two equalizers, one without the processor and one with the processor. So again, it's the same, same concept here.
And lastly is the transmit bandpass setting. So what we're going to do here is we're going to set that transmit bandpass so that our acoustic settings are nice and wide. We've got plenty of rich acoustical voice. And let me explain to you just a little bit about what, what's going on here. There's, there's an idea that if you have a much narrower pass band like CW, you might be able to get out further. And that's true. Uh, however, you do lose a lot of your voice quality here, but you can still communicate. So it, it's a much narrower passband, not acoustically as rich. But the other one is that I like to use is this guy right here. That gives me a nice wide acoustic uh, quality, and I find I make pretty good contacts. So let's go to the radio. We'll do some stuff, and then we'll uh, we'll wrap it up. All right, guys. Let's see. We're in front of the radio now. What I want to show you first is uh, I want to show you the uh, uh, parametric equalizer. Let me show you where to, to find these. I'm going to press FM list. And right there is the processor. And if I turn the processor off, then only one set of parametric settings will be used. If I turn on the processor here, <coughs> the processor settings specifically for the uh, uh, parametric equalizer will be used here. This is just the normal microphone equalizer that would be used like in AM and FM. So essentially what happens is you want to turn on the, the equalizer and if you're going to use a processor you can turn it on here and if you're if you want to turn it off you can also turn it off. Now when you're in AM mode, when you're in AM mode for example, the processor is automatically disabled so you can't see it right there. You see the processor is disabled right there. However, you still have the other parametric equalizer that will work in AM mode. So let's go back to sideband real quick. Alright, so let's go ahead and make some settings here. I've got the settings set for number one, test number one, which I showed in the video. And I'm going to show you the acoustics now with the processor on and the equalizer about four inches away from the microphone. Kilo India 5 Juliet Uniform Foxtrot. Kilo India 5 Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ CQ. Alright, that is with the uh, processor on. If I turn off the processor, still in sideband. Kilo India 5 Juliet Uniform Foxtrot. Notice the difference there? The processor gives you a little bit better punch. Kilo India 5. All right, so that's what the processor does. Now, let's go to AM real quick, and we'll go show you what those sound like. Now, in AM, with the processor on, I'm going to take off the treble boost here, and I'm going to turn off this guy right here, and I'll speak about four inches from the microphone. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform, Foxtrot. Now, again, we're not using the processor because it doesn't work in AM, So, but now I've, I'm using just the standard equalizer, so let me disable that. Kilo India 5, Juliet, Uniform, Foxtrot. We'll turn it back on. Kilo India 5, Juliet, Uniform, Foxtrot. So you get some advantages there with that uh, equalizer. Now, the last thing I'll show you is that is that transmit pass band, and we need to go back to... Uh, sideband real quick and I'm going to go to setting number 110 menu setup let's go to 110 real quick and I'll show you that pass band it's kind of important to see this right now I've got it set to 2900 we'll set it to the max that's the max right there I'm going to go ahead and put on my treble boost and I'm going to configure my microphone like this Kilo India 5, Juliet, Uniform, Foxtrot. Now I'm going to turn this down to narrow, which would be this guy right here. Notice the difference. Kilo India 5, Juliet, Uniform, Foxtrot. It's hard to tell over the here, but if you have a set of headphones on, you'll definitely be able to tell. But we're going to go ahead and leave this guy back at 3000, because that's where we like it. All right, let's, let's change the uh, settings. First, we'll do the processor without the... Uh, we'll do the parametric equalizer without the processor, which is settings 119 through 127, and then we'll do 128 to 136. So let's go through each one of these to set the processor menu list. We're going to go to 119, and we're hit select, and we're going to dial in. I've got to get my notes here where I can see it. We're going to dial in 100, and that's what we already have. So I'm going to press enter. 
I'm going to go down to 120 and we're going to change that to 8. We're going to go down to 121. We're going to change that to 5. Now we're going to go down to 122. We're going to change this to 1300. We're going to go down to 123. We're going to change that to negative 5. Then we're going to go down to 124. We're going to change that to 10. 125. We're going to change this to 2800. And then we're going to go down to 127. Excuse me, yeah. 128 will be, uh, sorry, I skipped one. 126 will be 8, and that's what we have it at. And then the last one we're going to change to 10. Now these settings here are without the parametric equalizer, so in the AM mode uh, or sideband with the parent processor turned off, these settings will take effect. Now let's go through and do this parametric equalizer with the speech processor engaged. It's going to be a different set of numbers. So the first one here is going to be 100. That's where we're going to leave it. And we're going to go to the next one. Change that one to 8. The next one we're going to change this one to 5. Next one we're going to change this one to 1300. Next one we're going to change this one to a negative 5. Next one we're going to change is this one will go to a plus 5. Next one we're going to change is we're going to change this to 2800. Next one we're going to change, we're going to change this one to 8. And the last one we're going to change is to 10. Now this is with the processor engaged. Notice the P in front of it right there. You have the P. So this is all these settings are with the parametric equalizer. So we're done here. So let's go ahead and click back. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go back over here and we're going to turn on the speech processor. I'm going to leave it at 23. My mic gain, I'll leave that at 25. And we're going to test. These are the new settings now for sub single sideband with the parametric equalizer with the processor engaged. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform, Foxtrot calling CQ, CQ, Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform, Foxtrot. Sounds really good. Uh, much deeper, much deeper. A little bit more acoustical bass than what I had previously. So now let's go to AM mode. We got the equalizer turned on, and let's see where our mic gain is set to. I lowered it, let me run it at about 35. So for AM, I'm going to turn this off, disable this guy here. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform, Foxtrot. Now let's go over here real quick. We'll turn off the equalizer because remember, in AM mode, the processor is grayed out. You can't, ha you don't have a processor in AM. So let's turn on, let's turn off the microphone equalizer. Kilo India Five Juliet Uniform Foxtrot. Turn it on. Kilo India Five Juliet Uniform Foxtrot. Kind of hard to tell the difference, but there is a there's a little bit more acoustical wideness to it, if you will. Uh, the other thing, uh, that's about it right there. What we can do also is, since we have re-recorded our messages, we can go back and record uh, new voice memos real quick. So like if I want to go here, uh, and I've got a video, I'll put the video in how to program these individual uh, channels, but since we've gone back and made some of our changes, I'm going to put everything back for sideband with, with this here. And we're going to record the first one here. We'll be uh, get set up here real quick. I'm going to hit, whoops, I'm going to hit number one. Is the whoops, we press memory, and then one is the frequency in use. Is the frequency in use? Is the frequency in use? Is the frequency in use? Okay, so there's our new recording there, and then we'll go ahead and set this one up here. Let me make sure I got the processor turned on. It doesn't sound like it's turned on. Oh, I'm in AM mode. <laughs> got to go back to F. Got to go back to sideband. There we go. Now let's re-record that again. Everything's turned on there. That looks good. We're gonna go memory. 
is the frequency in use is the frequency in use new settings is the frequency in use is the frequency in use okay now we're going to record the second one kilo india 5 whoop. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ, CQ 10 meter. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ 10 meter and listening. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ, CQ 10 meter. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ. So now those recordings are capturing my new voice acoustics, and the next one we'll do is, is, is just call sign only. Kilo India 5, Juliet, Uniform, Foxtrot. Kilo India 5, Juliet, Uniform, Foxtrot. All right, now let's go to AM real quick, and we'll set those up real quick. Got everything set like I want it here. We're going to record number four, is the frequency in use. Got to make sure I got my cowling off and my settings correct. Is the frequency in use? 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 We'll do that, we'll do that one again. Is the frequency in use? Is the frequency in use? All right, cool. Next one now, we'll do the last one with AM. Make sure the processor, the equalizer is turned on. I know it is. Yeah, it's turned on. The last one will be uh, calling CQ 10 meter AM. Kilo in Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ 10 meter. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ 10 meter AM and listening. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot. All right, let's listen to that. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ 10 meter. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot calling CQ 10 meter AM and listening. Kilo India 5, Juliet Uniform Foxtrot. All right, great. So we've gone through and I've showed you my first settings. I've changed the settings for both parametric uh, processor and the standard parametric. I've showed you the passband and showed you how to re-record those. So anyway, give these settings a try and actually play around with them. You can actually just sit there and turn the knobs and press enter and, and do it with your headphones on. That way you can hear really what it sounds like. All right, hope you enjoy the video and uh, hopefully we'll catch you on the air. 73.